Okay. Charles and Blanc here just want to have a minute. Just want to do a little video here on my little experience last night at the PC Convention Leadership, PC Leadership Convention at the Aiken Center. Now, we all know that I went there. I expected that they would allow me in there and I would say, okay, media, uh, we're bloggers, whatever, and let them tell me only Irving employees or whatever. Or I'm a social assistant, I'm a member, but I can't afford the $40. Either way, uh, it would have given me a good excuse not to attend that event, you know, like really, really, my ADHD, you know, just. But I did go in, and you know what? It was a good experience. It was. It was long, I was tired, but it was a good experience. But there's a couple of things here that bothers me. When I was standing there at the end, a kid, we won't mention his name. I promise some people I won't mention no names. But this kid, 16, 17 year old, approached me and said, hey, I'm whatever. I didn't know who this kid was. Don't have a clue. But in his head, I was supposed to know who he was. Then I seen his picture on Facebook and he's right with some MLAs and you know, like this kid and then other people approached me about this kid. They told me he's, uh, yeah, okay. But then this kid asked his buddy and then they thought, well, uh, are you, you media? Oh, I'm better than media. I'm a blogger. Now, if you listen to the tape, then he went and get the, I think it's security at UNB. And I think it was a, an immigrant. You look at the video, you, you tell me. And they thought this was a game. This guy comes in my face and told me, she was me, you have to leave. I was there for seven hours and I had to leave 15 minutes before the final vote. Well, there's no way I was gonna leave, but the situation could have turned very, very ugly, very, very fast. He would have grabbed me, we know what I do. Uh, these kids, then finally, when I start raising my voice, I thought it was a joke at first. It was no joke. And these kids, when the kids come to me after and said, Oh yeah, you gonna put this on, on YouTube tomorrow? I said, I'll be on YouTube tonight. Oh great! Then I seen him with his friend and they were laughing. It was a joke. So, I don't think this, I think the party if they want to have convention or events, you don't have kids in charge. Because like I said, their situation could have turned ugly very fast. The guy took the mic. Maybe there was more people that's going to show up. The police would have showed up. Oh boy, they would have loved that. It could have turned ugly very fast. So me, I was going to go after the kid, just his name, go to the party and Okay, we're just leaving. But I had to do this video. Now, there's another issue. This guy, this immigrant, was looking at me. Called me sir. You know, we, got a, we got a guy here. They didn't know who I was. But he asked me in the video about four or five times, can I see your media credential? 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 Whatever. Credential. Credential? What? What does that mean? You have to go to the Irving School? Irving owns all the newspapers in this province. All the newspapers are there gonna, you know, like it's the Irving way. So again, what, what is a journalist these days? What is it? Somebody just started a Facebook, he could be a journalist. Somebody starts a Twitter account, he could be a journalist. I mean, why specify, can I see your media credential? 
What the hell is that? A nerving soldier? I said I'm a blogger. And I think I'm a court-appointed journalist. But, you know, I mean, this is the game. Oh, the police. I mentioned me bloggers, and here they come. Where are you? I'm here. If I hear another siren, uh, as a journalist, I'll go and run. Run and uh, see what's going on. But, they have to be, like I said, I got distracted. What is a journalist? Me, myself, oh, a court-appointed journalist? That was 10 years ago. But, you know, I mean, some events, really, my ADHD cannot handle events. Yesterday, it was interesting. But I always went, everywhere I go, come on, I'm 57. Act like I'm, I'm 20. But anyway, that's another story, ADHD. If I'm approached with attitude, I will give them attitude. That's the way it is. The cops the same way. Cops wants to be, oh, hey, you're running a bicycle with no helmet? I'll fight back. Come to me after foolishness, I'll fight back. So, uh, the PC party has. You have events, get proper security. Don't have kids. Because, like I said, it could have turned ugly very, very fast. And as for media, you tell me, what's media? What do you got to be to be labeled as media? A nerving employee? What else? Oh, crazy world.